Hello, welcome to Card Minds. Thank you for stopping by. This is going to be a Leo weekly money and career reading for the 14th to the 20th of February, 2022. Welcome Leos. This is the first weekly money and career I'm doing for the sign of Leo. Thank you so much, Leos. Uh, I took a poll. I don't know if you participated, but I took a poll um, for uh, weekly reading signs I was going to read every Sunday. I cannot read uh, all 12 signs. I would love to, but I don't have the time. So let me put these back as I speak. So I think I'm going to take the top three signs and then I'll take a poll on another two, three signs to read for, so I can read five or six signs every Sunday. So thank you so much, Leos, for uh, subscribing if you haven't yet and coming to watch this first weekly reading. Okay, here we go. Weekly money and career for Leo. Taking a breather, taking a rest. Leo, money and career for February 14th to the 20th. Money and career, what's happening for the sign of Leo? What are you taking a rest from, Leo? Oops, these cards that want to sort of jump out. What, um, you're sort of realigning yourself you're 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 taking a moment you're taking a moment so whatever you've been working on leo um if it was difficult if the path is difficult if it's a new job or a job you're in queen of wands um this is something that you that is bringing you harmony leo that's bringing you happiness um this can be you. You're you're working hard. The Queen of Wands is very creative. She's a leader. She likes to make decisions. She likes to make things happen. Leo, you like to make things happen, right? You you have been yes. Look at this. Wow, Leo, beautiful. So, um, is it something you're just starting, or is it something that you're finally realizing that this is something you really enjoy, because you have the Sun, the Ten of Cups. The Six of Wands leading, self-confident, trusting yourself in this because it's your project, your job, your activity, your career, take it, your business, take it as it resonates for you, Leo. Look at you here in the sun, Leo. Um, you, it, it's just, you're beaming with happiness in this project. You, the, you're, you're, you have understood that you were the one guiding, you were the one leading in this job. So it is creative, it is bold, it is something you believed in. Maybe other people didn't believe in this. Maybe this is all of a sudden your revelation in your career and you know that you're the one that made it happen. Wow, Leo. So take a take a bow, Leo, because your 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 self-confidence is boosted and it's really really making you happy your family happy or your entourage the people that are around you and and you're beaming with happiness the sun is such a beautiful card and it's also the card of clarity you know knowing that this is um making you happy but making you blossom right um there are all kinds of things that are going to come out of this. This is making you open up to the world, open up your career, open up your ways, right? Leading the way in su it's success, but it's also it's just becoming extremely clear for you that this is your path. This is what you want. This is where you belong. Aha. All right. So now I understand why you have the four of swords because of the three of swords so you might have just lost a job or you left a job or you were disappointed in a project a career a job a business you know take it as it resonates for you and that is why you had to take a breather um you you just 
needed a break. But my oh my, Leo, this break is leading to something so much more fulfilling and something that you really, really understand now that it's for you. You connect with this and it's successful. The sun is about success, but it's also about blooming, boss, blossoming, right? You're blossoming in your career in this or this or this project that you're leading is making you blossom. And the Queen of Wands, you are the Queen of Wands, Leah. You are that bold uh, entrepreneur, that bold leader, manager, boss. I feel, I feel like you're the boss on this, Leo. Comment down below. Let me know what your journey is all about. Let me know what this is all about, Leo. All right, let's see if there's one more card or, or three. Okay. And then we'll move on to the other ones. Yes. Yes. It's new. It's new. You're the boss. And you're moving forward. It cannot be clearer than that. But it's a new career. It's a new project. It is a new job, whatever it is. I, I honestly think you reoriented yourself and now you're, you're leading a completely new project. This is new and you are the emperor leading the way. You're very powerful in this, uh, Leo. You have called the shots. You have made this happen. The emperor is all about authority, action forward, but stabilizing everything. I think that's why you needed that moment. Three of swords, four of swords. It was difficult. You just came out of a difficult path. You just were let go of a job or left your job or left a project that was disappointed and you needed to regroup. But my, is this week pushing you forward. Whatever you've decided, whatever you're starting, Leo, this is action packed forward, but you, you're building this, right? It's not, you're, you're just starting this. So you're building this, but you're leading the way you're taking the responsibility. You're making the decisions and, but you're building it. And this action forward, this beginning is bringing you, uh, stability, family stability, harmony in your life, peace of mind, peace of mind that now you've found this journey, project, career, job, take it as it resonates. And you have the wheel of fortune. So once you pass this difficult situation here, you're moving forward on that optimistic, the sun and the wheel of fortune, the optimistic um, energy. You are unblocking the situation. You probably, I don't know, I don't remember my other readings. Maybe you want to check out the readings in the Money and Career readings in January January or, or mid-January and February to see what the situation was. But you clearly unblock the situation with your decisions to start this new project. And that is moving forward. It's bringing you positive vibes. It's giving you energy, positive energy. You have a bounce in your step. You're happy. Uh, this is something that is utter joy and fulfillment in your life. Wow, that's wonderful. And the Wheel of Fortune is just saying that, yes, there were obstacles. Yes, there are ups and downs. Yes, you had to make decisions. But at the end of the day, you unblock the situation and now you're pushing forward. Now you're going to see synchronicities. Now you're going to see, you're, you're going to meet the right people or they're finally going to answer the phone or, or, or answer your questions or you're going to get that call back or you're going to get those finances or you're going to get that contract or you're going to, you know, yada, yada, yada. It's, it's sort of opening up. The doors are opening up because you made that decision and you decided to go on your path, your way. Fulfilling very fulfilling and but but it is it is true that the wheel of fortune is always there to say that it's not that easy right the wheel of fortune is yes it brings good karma in right yes it 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 um it tells you that the wheel is starting to turn again right but it also says that 
this is where you belong. This is your destiny. This, you are transforming this professional path into your de destiny. This is your, um, what you're moving forward now, what you're making happen is you are where you belong. You're destined to do this. And this transformation, what you're moving forward now, is a transformation. It is different. It is a different cycle. This is a cycle moving forward, new cycle. And now positive is coming in. The right people, right? Instead of BS here, the right people. It's not going to be conflictual constantly. It's going to be, you know, with a good team on the same wavelength, good conversations, being able, being able to move forward on projects, not being stuck every time with ego situations or people that don't believe in you or people that are, don't agree with you or just people going to, they're, they're going to, sorry, I can't speak too many words jumbling out at the same time that are going to battle every step of the way, right? This is your path. Let me know, Leo, what you're doing, because this is awesome. I mean, the Wheel of Fortune, the Sun, the Emperor, and you are in your power. It is, you know, the, the Emperor is about, uh, I, it, the Emperor is about finding your own and understanding that you are solely in your power. Yes, you're powering a project. Yes, you're powering and leading another, you know, other people, but this is, is something that is aligning yourself with who you are. And that brings power. When you know you're in the right place, that doubles, triples the power, but the positive power, the good stuff. Yes, and here we go, Seven of Swords. Yes, that was betrayal or people that didn't believe in you or people that lied to you or people, sneaky, sneaky, sneaky behavior, whatever it was, sneaky behavior. Maybe someone um, um, offered you something and they didn't, you know, it, it didn't pan out, right? They BS'd you. Uh, you know, maybe someone um, really uh, didn't have your back. Maybe... You had colleagues or, you know, coworkers that didn't have your back or people promised things to you that you never got. Maybe someone promised you a promotion. Maybe, you know, whatever it is, you felt betrayed. You felt those people didn't deserve you. Anyway, that is why you're moving on to your path. Why is the emperor here? Clarify the emperor. I'm trying to make these short. Uh, Leo, comment down below. Let me know if you enjoy this reading. This is the first time I'm doing a, a Leo Weekly Money and Career. So if you want to keep going on the weeklies, uh, let me know if um, this is something you're interested in. Too many cards. Leo, uh, why is the Emperor here? So let me know if this is interesting and you connect with it and you would like to see more. Leo, yes, I keep getting this. Okay, you were stuck. Clearly you were stuck. Clearly you were stuck and clearly you felt betrayed. But this whole thing here opened your eyes. This whole thing here opened your eyes to this new path. Let's see if we can get uh, something on this Ace of Wands since the Emperor is not revealing any messages. Let me see. Ace of Wands. Why is the Ace of Wands here? trying to get a little more information although we have a lot all right let's take these cards let's see what's up yes so again this three of swords so this is something clearly that has just happened um because the the, the cards keep coming out it has been very difficult for you it was heart-wrenching if you say that you know it was it, it it was just hurtful whatever they did to you you know, or even, but usually the three of swords, it's loss of a job or loss of finances uh, in a job or in a project or in a business, right? So you, you, but you hung tight, you hung tight, four of swords, you took a breather, you understood you had to take a step back to see clear, to breathe and to understand what happened and what the next step was going to be and how you were going to implement the next step. So kudos to that. And if you're in the middle of this right now, just know that, look at this. This 
is looking pretty damn good, um, Leo. But it requires you to make, so if you're right in the middle of this, it requires you to make a bold decision. So maybe you are quitting that job. Maybe you are changing careers. Maybe you are starting that business you ever did. Maybe you are going back to school for new skills, you know, to start that business, to start that new career because you've saved money on this. And you know what, Leo? It seems like this is not something you've been sharing with too many people. You've been closed off on this. It has been very difficult, but you kept it to yourself and you also kept your, you managed your finances tightly to be able to make this decision. The judgment is about um, making the decision for change, understanding that it is time to move on to something else. It is time to let go of this thing that is not working, that does not belong to you anymore, and that you you definitely have to steer the bar um, in a different way. And you're rising up. You are rising up. You are re reborn, right, almost, because it's giving you so much stamina. And you are destined to this. This is your destined path, your destined career, right? So that is why you feel so much comfortable in this um, in this career. Uh, this is this is where you belong, and and you're ready now. You're ready to act. You're ready to do this, and you're leading the way. And your self this has really boosted your self confidence. So let go of that old. Judgment is let go of your old self. Step into this newer version of yourself, of who you really are, what you really set, you know, what, what, how you really set the bar, Leo, because you set the bar high. And you're, this, in, this decision you're making is a blend of sort of intellect and intuition. You're putting it all in and you know, you know, you have to go there. You know, this is going to be different and you're changing your path. It's a crossroads. It's a milestone. It's a crossroads. This decision is a crossroad. Any, any choice here, any decision here is significant change a significant change in your in your career in your job in your profession in your business take it as it resonates but it is it is so fulfilling and it, you're on the right track you're almost there you're almost there because if you're still here in the three of swords trust yourself that you're almost there and and it's nothing but sunshine and wheel of fortune after that so that's pretty cool all the pieces are coming together, um, Leo. All the pieces are coming together. Let's see if there's one more card. Uh, let me take the other, the other deck. Let's see if there's one message for the road. I'm trying to make these not too long. Let's see if there's one more message for the road, Leo. Thank you so much for your likes, your shares. Yes, the hangman, not surprising. Take a step back, take a breather, you know, see, see the big picture. And that I think that's what you're doing. So if you haven't experienced this yet, and this is something you connect with, and you, you're feeling that this is your trajectory, your journey, don't push, 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 push. This is coming uh, organically. This is coming naturally, Leo, right? And this is um, just a moment in time where you have to let, once you let go, this, yes, this you have to let go. Take the time to let go of the negative energies and surrender to the negative energies, right? And now take, take a moment to, you know, and surrender to the opportunity to pause and reassess and reevaluate where you are, right? Once you, once you have paused here, once and let go, because 
what this this is all emerging this is all coming up once you let go of that and you will be able to you, you you're not going to be able to see it and you will be able to see it but you won't be able to see it if you don't let go of this negative energy that was so hard for you so allow it to come in allow the time and space for it to come in right and i think that's exactly what you're doing here with the four of swords pause and surrender to the situation and even if it's different but i don't think you care that it's different leo because this is what you want you want different and it's clear for you it is so clear for you don't resist for sure don't resist beautiful reading leo i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if it's the first time you are coming to watch a reading on my channel, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell. That's very important. Um, I will be uploading mid-month money and careers for all signs as well as monthlies, of course. Uh, I do a lot of money and careers that people seem to connect with. So if you, you have never watched any, you might want to check out the February month and careers, uh, money and careers, Leo. Um, and uh, I will be uploading every Sunday uh, weeklies. Um, so keep watching and I, 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 I will try to rotate some signs every Sunday. Thank you so much for watching, Leo. Take care. Bye-bye.